Welcome to Cedarcroft. I'm glad you're here. Today, we are going to make stuffed peppers. Let's get started. Our stuffed pepper recipe is pretty straightforward. This is a recipe that my mom always made for me when I was growing up. And quite honestly, I have tried other people's stuffed peppers and I am just not a fan. So, my mom's, I am definitely a fan. So what we're gonna do, aren't these peppers beautiful? So we got these peppers from Sam's Club, and they were supposed to be the tricolor, but we got orange and red. No yellow this time, but we're not complaining because these are big and beautiful. So I've got eight peppers here. I have about 60 ounces of pasta sauce, spaghetti sauce, and two pounds of cooked ground beef. I have the tops of those peppers, which we cut up into bite-sized pieces. And I have four cups of cooked rice. And this, I have four cups. I think we're only going to use three cups today but we will see, won't we? So this is super, super easy uh, to put together. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is put the ground beef into the sauce. There we go. We are going to put the rest of the peppers, the tops of the peppers that we chopped up, we're going to put that in the sauce and about three cups of this rice in the sauce. Okay. Now we are going to stir all of this together. As you can see, I made the rice earlier and put it in the fridge. So we're going to have to incorporate all of these flavors together. And I can tell that we need more rice. Do you see what that looks like? Not enough rice for me. Okay, this is looking much better to me. So a full three cups of cooked rice. There we go. Let's get stuffing these peppers. And then we're going to fill the middle. because that in the middle is just an unstuffed pepper. And boy, we like those too. All right. Now we're going to cook this in the oven at 350 covered. I'm going to cover this with tin foil and we're going to cook this at 350 for 45 minutes to one hour. We're going to check it and make sure it's not burning. In the last maybe 10 minutes, we can take the top off and um, just let it make sure that it's getting good and done. So I'm gonna put the top on and we'll get it in the oven and I'll bring you back when it is ready. Isn't that beautiful? I can't wait. Take a look at these delicious stuffed peppers. Now, one thing I forgot to tell you is I baked it with um, the tin foil for 45 minutes. And then what I did was I took the tin foil off and I took some reserve pasta sauce, reserve spaghetti sauce, and I poured it on top of these stuffed peppers to keep them moist. And then I took the 
um, tin foil off and I let it bake for another half hour. And so that's how long these have been baking. I'm ready now to do a taste test and I'm so excited. There is no way that I can eat a whole one of these really delicious, large, <laughs> beautiful stuffed peppers. But I am going to put one here and we are going to give it a little taste. Look at this delicious stuffed pepper. Oh my goodness. Let's give it a little taste. Now, it's gonna be hard to get all of that goodness, but I'm going to go ahead and do that. Look at the inside, it's so hot. I don't know if you can see the steam. I'm afraid to take a bite right now because I know it's so hot. Let me take a little bite. Mm -hmm. This is so delicious. Oh my goodness, absolutely delicious. Thank you for joining me here on Cedarcroft and thank you for watching the video. This one was especially fun to make and delicious. I hope that you give it a try. And as always, until next time, take care and have a great day.